atakuwa chokora Nairobi apigwe risasi nikakote baiti kule kwenye mto kuja kumchukua mwanangu nguvu na amekuja tu e, kama surprise ya kuweza kumleta mama yake Nairobi afanye mambo mengi tu lakini sitaki nizungumze sana wacha the entertainment critic officer Vincent Mboya yeah. aseme kwa kivivi bro nikushukuru sana nikopoa uh -huh. Mungu anasaidia uh -huh. na pia nashukuru venye mmejitokeza kwa wingi kuja uh -huh. kumpokea uh -huh mamangu umeelewa uh -huh. uh -huh. na leo ni siku tu moja furaha sana uh -huh. sababu ni siku pia ya historia uh -huh. nimeweka katika ni maisha ya mamangu uh -huh. ikuikiwa marake ya kwanza mamangu kupanda ndege uh -huh. ndio ndio yeah. yes. na juzi tumekuwa na wewe Nairobi ume fly lini merudi lini Mombasa jana jana ah jana eh yeah. tumekuwa na jana nimeendrudi jana jana usiku nikaingia asubuhi leo mimi siku hizi huwa silali na lala tutu tu nilikuwa safarini most of the time yeah yeah acha tuzungumze na mama mboya kidogo habari mambo nzuri sana unajisije siku ya leo nime nimefurahi huwa nasikia tu CV international sijui airport sasa nimeanza na kule Mombasa. Uh -huh. Sasa naona niko na mbwa niko Nairobi. Uh -huh. Na hata masaa mawili haijaisha. Uh -huh. Sasa ni Nashukuru, yeah. nashukuru. Eh. Okay. Imekuwa ni mara yako ya kwanza of course. Eh? Nataka tu kujua wewe safari umeisikia sikiaje kwa mara ya kwanza umeisikiaje? Kwanza nili, nilikuwa nasikia mwanzo nimesikia nyakana nasikia kisunzi hivi nikajishikilia nikajikaza mwisho nika ilibidi nifunge macho kiasi alafu baadaye nika nikazoea ule ile ndio nikafungua macho ya kijana wako amekuwa na jituma sana na hatumai umekuwa ukiona kwenye mitandao lakini kabla ya you know mboya kuweza kutusua kwenye maisha na mambo yawe mazuri alikuwa anapitia you know watu wana wanamsimanga wanasema hataweza huo wakati wewe ulikuwa unasikiaje na ulikuwa ushawahi kufikiria kwamba itafika mahali Vincent aweze kukulipia ndege uje Nairobi hata ni mshtuko si kwa hii hata siku moja mm -hmm. manake niliambiwa mengi mpaka mwisho niliambiwa atakuwa chokora Nairobi apigwe risasi nikakote baiti kule kwenye mto lakini nilikuwa naomba tu nilioma nili, maisha yangu yote ni kuomba leo hii yuko hapa na ni mzima na akwa ipigwa risasi naambia Mungu tu asante mm -hmm. eh, Vincent Mboya we unamjua eh, akikuwa kama mtoto wa aina gani kwa sababu huku Nairobi alipokuja watu wengi walifikiria ni mtoto mtukutu sana wewe unamfahamu kama mtoto wa gani ni mtoto mwenye anapenda mambo ya Mungu mm -hmm. anamcha Mungu mm -hmm. nimemlea katika misingi ya kanisa mm -hmm. na hata leo hii ma sister na mafadha huwa wanamuita kijana wangu mm -hmm. akija Mombasa kila fadha atauliza mbona hujapitia mm -hmm. ma sister yuko wapi kijana wangu hata mm -hmm. wao nuwa na mwambie hizo vitu zako usifanye vituko huko mm -hmm. mafadha na ma sister wa changamo wa Mombasa wote wana follow hizi vitu mm -hmm. ananiambia mama usio na wasiwasi sitawahi kukwaibisha mm -hmm. Eh. na pengine we wakati unamlea Mboya Vincent that is si huku tumezoea kumuita Mboya wakati unamlea Vincent <laughs> wewe ulikuwa na ndoto aje akue akue kitu gani maishani mimi wakati nikimlea mm. ndoto yangu sana ilikuwa ni akue daktari mm -hmm. paka kuna nyimbo ilikuwa ina, inaimba asubuhi kwamba hata kama unataka niwe daktari lakini nitakuwa daktari mwenye kuimba mziki mm -hmm. nyimbo ilikuwa napenda kuimba asubuhi sasa ningeamka nisikie nyimbo ningemuombea mm -hmm baka nimpe mfano hata akina wa huu wamesomwa kwa na madegree mm -hmm. ndio wameingia huko pia we nataka degree ndio uingie huko mm -hmm. hiyo tu ndio nilikuwa namwambia kila wakati mm -hmm. eh kitu, kitu gani ambacho kinakufurahisha sana you know eh, sasa hivi kwenye maisha ya mboya ukimwangalia kile kinanifurahisha ni kwamba hakuingia mambo ya ulevi mambo za drugs sana na kila hakika 
anakumbuka kwamba nina nina mahali naita nyumbani ndio yeah. Vincent wewe uliwahi kufikiria kwamba hii siku itafika utamleta mamako alafu wana habari tutakuja tukulaki airport uh, honestly speaking hapana sijafikiria hivyo mm-hmm. but it was among my dreams umeelewa mm-hmm. it it could happen but siku natarajia itakuja ku happen very fast like this but mm-hmm. nilikuwa katika plan zangu ilikuwa nilikuwa nasema hii mwaka lazima mamangu apande ndege hiyo mm-hmm. because kila saa nilikuwa nikienda nyumbani na, na ndege mamangu ananiambia wewe Unapanda ndege na mimi sijapanda ndege. So kila siku huwa nikienda tu nyumba sababu mostly siku hizi natumia ndege. Mm-hmm. Hata nilipoenda Dubai, mwanga mm-hmm. naambia ah, huwa umeenda Dubai na mimi sijapanda hata ndege. Sasa nikasema I think it's high time right now. Mm-hmm. I just surprise her with her mm-hmm. with, with, with the flight experience na sea flight experience too mm-hmm. with the holiday. Well, wow. mm-hmm. So I'm so happy and I'm so humbled for her to raise me vile nyenye niko mpaka sasa hivi mm-hmm. alafu na, na bado pia unajua amekukuja Nairobi ndio mimi naishi huko Nairobi lakini hajakuja Nairobi sababu ya eh, eh, ya kuja kwangu amekuwa amekuja huko Nairobi sababu ya holiday umeelewa mm-hmm. mm-hmm. so atakuwa anazunguka zunguka hizo mapark ma kidogo hapa na pale mm-hmm. and all this i'm just doing to show the people who looked down on to us mm-hmm. the people who walikuwa namtumia mamangu the worst ni mamangu si mtu wa mtandao mm-hmm. Nilikuwa ile wakati nilikuwa nilikuwa sana kitrend mwangu anatutumua screenshots. Mhm. Mwangu si mtu mpendao kabisa. Mhm. Akini kifanya chochote anatumua screenshot, anatumua screenshot afa anaambiwa tu nini um ni ni mwanao umeelewa? So uh, it hasn't been easy but right now I think she's happy mm-hmm. and uh, also there is more to come. Wow. Leave alone e ma, ma surprises. Surprises bado ni mingi mingi mingi. I want to see her. I want to see her prim, I pray her primonious tooth ile ile ndo primola mm-hmm. ile aki smile mm-hmm. nione tu aki smile mm-hmm. so far sijaiona okay surprise mbili sijaiona baba okay pengine mipango ya holiday inakuwa ni gani unataka aende wapi azunguke wapi uh, ama inakuwa ni unajua uh, first of all eh, mm-hmm. niliposema nataka kuleta mwangu huku kuna jamaa anaitwa expedition masai safari za mm-hmm. ndo akanambia mboi nini hiyo idea iko poa sana mm-hmm. ndo akanambia ni wakikuja watanisaidia mwangu aende katika park mm-hmm. Nairobi National Park waende akaangalia wanyama nini nini mm-hmm. alafu afta hapo mm-hmm. eh, azunguke pia ni kidogo uh, aende mwangu pia ni mtu anapenda ni kucheka mm-hmm. na bado this weekend kuna love festival ndaka mm-hmm. enda akakutane na wale wachekeshaji wake one on one live mm-hmm. ndio oh. alafu live, live alone that pia kama itawezekana pia ningeomba pia eh, akutane pia na jalango oh. eh. jalango ule jamaa fulani <laughs> aliyosababisha <alio> fulani <laughs> anyways uh, ongera sana mboya like mimi you. unajua nimekuwa miongoni mwa watu ambao wanakubali yeah, na wana support lakini wezidi kujituma yeah. um, um, mama mboya pengine maneno yako ya mwisho kwa, kwa, kwa watu wengi unajua kuna watu ambao wamekuwa kimmuonyesha mboya chuki lakini kuna watu ambao wamekuwa kimpenda wakimjali na kumsupport ungependa kuambia mimi nashukuru wale wote ambao wamemshika Vincent Mkono mpaka pale amefikia mm-hmm. because si kawaida mm-hmm. alitoka Mombasa two short story hiyo siku tulikuwa tunapenda kuangalia African movie usiku saa sita tuko naye mm-hmm. akaniambia mam kalale we nawe mam kalale we nawe ah <laughs> nashindwa hii kalale ya leo mimi nikaingia kulala Vincent aliandika barua akaiacha juu ya meza nikitoka saa 8 za usiku vize tayoko kitandani mlango uko wazi nikifungua gate dogi imeenda Vincent ayuko nikabakia na kulia na hiyo barua I've gone to explore the world na hana simu e, ni, ni, ni mbali sasa kutoka huko mpaka pale amefikia leo hii anati ameenda Nairobi ajui mtu ana relative hata siju fair alitoka wapi huwa sijui huwa nashindwa kuelewa na shukuru wale walimshika mkono kuanzia hiyo siku ya kwanza alivyo kanyaga Nairobi mpaka saa hii bado anaendelea kumshika mkono mimi nazidi tu kuombea Mungu sina la kuwalipa sina chochote lakini nitawaombea tu kila siku na sitaacha kuomba maana naona Mungu katika maisha yangu na katika maisha ya familia yote ambayo niko nayo sasa hizi. Na shukuru sana wa Kenya. Nasema ni asante. Nasidi tu kwa shukuru. Okay. Asante sana.
Someone out there may think that uh, may, may ask him, him or herself, like, why only mom and not dad? You can tell us. Currently, my father is in China. So, Lazima is in China. So, Lazima is in China. But, I have a lot of land to live in. I have a lot of international arrivals. I have a lot of land to live in. I have a lot of land to live in.